Uh, we're in Miami, Florida. Uh, we're in downtown Miami, Florida, specifically the Miami River, which is an area uh, that for the, for the longest time was uh, underdeveloped out of ne necessity. My father built a restaurant. Uh, they had the same business in Cuba, which was fishing and selling. So when he got to America, he started fishing immediately. And now it's become a real destination and a hot spot. So he's not with us, but he was right. Today we're going to do a, a, our, one of our signature dishes. It's a, it's a yellowtail filet with some shrimp in our uh, homemade cilantro sauce. I think it's a fairly simple recipe and it's something that you guys can pull off at home. So here I have the yellowtail, which is a yellowtail snapper. I got our jumbo shrimp. And here's our cilantro paste. Um, it's essentially what we do is we get our cilantro and the uh, extra virgin olive oil and we put them in a blender. Uh, this is our heavy cream, this is our salt, and the lime finishes it off. Okay, yeah, what I'm doing here is just gonna kind of widen a, a little bit of the cut of this shrimp. I do uh, like to season my product with complete seasoning. Um, I'd like to keep it basic. The fresh fish uh, should be the actual best ingredient in the whole bunch. So I try to keep it simple. I put the fish right in there, throw the shrimp in there as well. A little bit more olive oil. And then I let that sit for a bit. I have a passion for, for being uh, around uh, human beings and the human experience. And I feel that this is an extension of my home. This is the way I was raised. Um, anytime somebody comes to our restaurant, um, I would like them to feel as if they're coming into my home or our home. I go ahead and put the paste in there. A little bit of the heavy cream. You hear my mom in the background, she's reprimanding me and setting me straight. A little bit of salt. Then, half a lime. This will become a light sauce. And now the secret to us is it's a little bit of our broth, the homemade broth that we use. That broth is made from the actual fish that we cut up. So what happens is that broth is so concentrated, it gives it a certain, uh, another level. The responsibility that we have as a family toward the seafood business, it goes way back. The resources um, have to be kept and then maintained, and we, we we like to we'd like to have uh, you know plenty of seafood uh, for my kids and kids and your kids and the future of the of Garcias for sure is uh, it um, it hinges on on the fact that we uh, take care of the ocean. It's just the feel of being in the family business. Um, when you walk in, there's always a Garcia here, and um, I hope that that gives it an extra element of why people come here. I know that a lot of our customers don't even need to see the menu. They already know what they want. It's the hardest thing in the world to, to work with your family, but it's incredibly fulfilling and it's incredibly wonderful at the same time. My dad was trying to leave us something that I get now that he did for me. So we did this second floor essentially to say thank you. I think that my dad, if I, if I were to show him the finished product, I would know in an instant if I looked at his eye. I would know that he was proud. See all this stuff down here? That stuff right there? That's magic. If I can put some of that in there. Again, thank you uh, for uh, being a part of this and being with me today. And I hope that you guys will come through here when you're in Miami. My name is Luis Garcia, and this is the Panama Journey.